What's up, what's up, what's up, man? It's Nick Chavez, man, a.k.a. Mr. Be Prepared, Not Scared. So, um, today we're going to have some fun. We really, really going to have some fun, right? So, um, before we get started, though, um, some people are like, man, what's this good life program I'm hearing about? The good life is get out of debt or get out of dysfunction. Get out of financial dysfunction, right? So, before I go to the board, I'm going to go to the board and show y'all some things and break some stuff down. But, um, I want you to do something for me real quick. Take about 10 seconds. Hopefully, you're not driving nothing. If you're driving, just don't do what I say, but, you know, just the concept, the theory of it, right? So, I want you to close your eyes for a minute, right? And think about if... If money wasn't the issue for you, if money wasn't the problem, you ain't had to worry about money or none of that stuff because you well off and you good. If money wasn't the issue for you, how would the good life look for you? How would the good life look to you? What would that look like, right? So I really want you to think about it, really think about like when you was younger, what you thought about, oh man, like when I get old, I want to do this or, or what, like what, what brings that happiness to you, right? So I'm going to be quiet for like five or ten seconds, okay? All right. Just think about it. All right, cool. All right, so look, now the first thing I want to talk about, right, is you got to know your company. So it's two different types of companies as far as uh, life insurance, right? So we got a mutual company. Then we got a stockholders company, right? So with the mutual company, a mutual company is like it's a private firm that focuses on the policy holders, right? The policy holders essentially are big, like you can say you can consider them part owners of the mutual company. Um, so it works with the policy holders and the policy owners, the policy holders get dividends. That means that when the company makes money, the policyholder makes money, right? Stockholders, this is geared more for the, the stockers, right? The people that own the stock owners, the people that own the stock in this company. So when this company make money, the people that own the stocks make money. So it's not really, it's not really geared for the policyholders as a mutual company would be, right? So now that we got that out the way, so know your company, right? Now you're about to have some fun. You're about to have some fun. So, I'm going to give you an example. So, say we got a life insurance policy, right? That is $250,000. A $250,000 life, life insurance policy, right? Um, and over here, we go going to have, like, just some bills, right? We, go, we got a car. We got a house. And we got student loans, right? So now we got, we're going to get these, we just going to give them numbers. So the car, let's say your car, 15000 Your house, 150000 You bought You bought the house in a short sale, so that's why the 150000 right? You, 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 go to, you go to the old deal for it. Student loan, let's just say, I would say bend over, but I ain't gonna mess with them like that. But your student loan is, is, is a nice little piece. So we're gonna say your student loan is 25K. Your student loan worth more than your car, right? And just say, with this, with this, this is your, this right here is your collateral. So with paying on this each month, you're gonna, you're gonna earn something called cash value. So just say you got, 10k cash value. Now, this is where this particular program works for like this. So most people think like, all right, cool. So I'm gonna take my cash value out and pay that, and that's how I'm gonna get out of debt in nine years or less. No, that's not the case. What you're gonna do is you're gonna take a loan against this, or you take a take a loan against this using your policy as collateral. So basically, the money is always circulating, right? So you take the money out and then at a lot of times, 
Like the program sets it up so that I don't want you to think that, oh, in nine years, all this stuff is just going to drop off. No, some of this stuff is going to drop off sooner than in nine years, just that the house, because that's normally your biggest, your biggest expense. This one is going to take nine years or less. So it could take less than nine years or not. But a lot of times through the nine years, you'll pay the car off. You might pay the student loan off next, and then you'll pay the house off, right? So basically, the whole time while you're taking the loan against this and you're you're getting you're, you're using your policy as collateral, you're still paying your monthly premium. So by still paying your monthly premium, you're still getting you're still getting interest earned on this. You're still getting that cash value. That cash value is still growing, growing and growing and growing. So you're still getting that. So basically all you're doing is just recirculating the money. You're recirculating the money, man. So this is the power of leverage and the power of just using other people's money to get yourself out of debt. So as soon as you get out of debt, what you say? As soon as you get out of debt, right? Now you're out of debt. Um, instead of you paying or instead of you being and the mortgage, or whatever the case may be, for 30 years, right? Now you're out of debt, nine years or less. So, you say, ah, right, you already used to paying whatever you're paying for your bills. So you already used to paying that. Why don't you put that to a tax-free type of retirement before you set yourself up, right? So, anybody know, I ain't going to say anybody know, but most of us know that 101, that's like, it's like English 101, algebra 101, like it's like the beginning of something, right? Like you would knew something new, right? So this particular 101 represents the section in the IRS code 101, right? Which means that um, with life insurance, it's a whole different section that it causes the beneficiary, right, to get their money. Tax free. So why would you put yourself in a tax deferred type program like a 401k or anything like that when you could do tax free, right? So like, man, it's, it's the power of leverage. This is what the banks do. The banks do this type of stuff. Like if you look at the banks, like what do you call it? Um, they're checking checks and balances or I, can't, I think it's what it's called. But if you look at the bank statements, right? Like one of their biggest investments is cash value life insurance. So. With that being said, man, um, understand your company, right? Mutual companies do this. And the particular company, one of the particular companies I write for, like they specialize in this. All companies don't do this, but this particular company specializes in it. So with them specializing in that, man, uh, if you if you know anybody or if you're in a situation where so you, you got a house, you want to pay the house off faster, you want to build your retirement, you want to build your money up, you want to save some money for your kids or your grandkids going to school, you want to pay that student loan off, man, why wait and and pay it off the time they tell you to pay it off and then you 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 paying double because you're getting that interest and doing to you and then, like, why do that when you can do it quicker, cut the interest down, right? So... Um, you can check my website out if you need any more information, if you need to come in, schedule an appointment so you can see how it works with your particular numbers and see how soon it'll take you to get out of your situation, out of your get out of get, get out of debt, good life, G-O-O-D, get out of debt, get out of dysfunction, financial dysfunction. You know, like so if you need to set up an appointment, go to my website, www.bepreparednotscared.net. Um if you like my channel, man, send this to people you might know, real estate agents or people that own houses, people that got student loans. Comment on it, share it, um, let me know what you think. Uh, and then the one, another good thing is, not only when you set up this program, when you come to the office and you know you make an appointment, like my business partner is a tax law accountant, so we put together certain little things that that's tax favorable for you by using the life insurance, man. So. Like really, just 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 start a new beginning, man. Like stop breaking. If if you if you come from a family or a place where you were struggling or you don't really understand money, man, come here, understand money, man. Break that generational curse and break that generational cycle. That oh ah oh, man, I'm already going to have to pay the house off. I got 30 years. I probably die before I pay the. No, you ain't gotta do that. We can show you how to make that money work for you, man, in a better way. So like I said, man. Go to the website, www.beprepared.notscared. Um, comment on the video, like the video, share the video with whoever you think might be interested in it or whoever you think might benefit from it. So, um, 
Thank you, man. Y'all be blessed. And until next Wednesday, man, I'll see y'all later, man. Be prepared, not scared, man.